Almita Inventory Distributor, AID. How to manage purchase orders. Select the Activities menu tab, then click the Manage POs choice. The Purchase Orders and RFQs screen will open. To create a new purchase order, click the yellow plus button. On the next screen, click yes for a new order. A new purchase order has been created. Select a supplier from the supplier drop-down list. If it is a new supplier, double-click the supplier field. The supplier screen appears. Click the yellow plus button, specify the supplier ID and press the enter key. We use a supplier name abbreviation for the IDs in this presentation. Try to abbreviate the name to make it unique and easily associated with the supplier, so a record can be quickly pulled out from a drop-down list. On the same screen, specify the supplier company name in the name field, then the mailing address. When you are finished, close the supplier screen and select a new supplier from the supplier drop-down list. Select the delivery address in the Ship To field. Populate other fields if needed. Now you can start adding items that you have bought. In the line items, start with an empty row and select the item ID. Change the quantity bought if more than one, and the unit price if different from the one in your database. Continue adding items by going down to an empty row for each new item. While adding line items, if you do not know the product item ID, double-click the item ID field. The inventory items screen will open. In the search field, type in a word or two which you think should be in the product description. The items will be filtered for you. Select the item, click the copy button at the top left, return to the purchase orders screen, and paste the copied ID into the line item. After all information has been added to the purchase order, you can print it out if needed. To print it, click the print button at the top of the screen. Then double-click the Purchase Order or RFQ form choice. If you ever need to delete this purchase order, return to this screen, find the order, and click the Trash Can button located on the top left corner of the screen. Let us now send payment to the supplier and receive the product. At the bottom of the purchase orders screen, click the send payment button. The payment detail screen appears. Click the blue left arrow button to populate the amount field. Click the save and close button. When product arrives, follow the activities menu tab, POs receive. Find the purchase order in the list and double click it. The Inventory Positive Adjustment screen appears with all line items pre-populated on it. If there are no specific serial numbers and you do not know a storage location, just click the Save Receipt button and you are finished. However, if you need to specify serial numbers, locations, or other specifics, drill down to each such line item. Select Location, Specify Serial, and Other Information. After all is done, click the Save Receipt button. Confirm the Save Receipt message. Close the purchase order if you are not expecting any future shipments against it.